Alrighty, what's going on guys? Welcome. Uh, yeah, this is Diablo 4. I have actually loved Diablo. The series has been great. I love it. Um, I really wanted to play Diablo 4 when it first came out, but I never did. But now it's on Game Pass, so hell yeah. Let's go. Uh, we finally get to play this amazing game. I don't even know if everybody else thinks it's amazing, but I love Diablo, so there's no way I'm not going to like this game. But we're going to start. First thing we did, create our character. Alrighty, let's go ahead and play some Diablo. Um, we're gonna pick our character first. We're gonna do Necromancer for sure, cause it's so easy. Um, we'll be a chick. We'll go with like a um, like gothic looking girl. Customize her. This already looks pretty good. We might just stick with this. But eyes is cool. Yeah, yeah. Scars. That's pretty good. Alrighty, so we got our necromancer. Alrighty, so once we finish creating our uh, necromancer, it was time to hop into the game. And yeah, get greeted with the awesome cutscene, setting the stage of where we're at in our life, I guess, of where we're at in the world. Sanctuary was never meant for humankind. It was forged as a refuge from the war between the high heavens and the burning hells. Instead, it became a new battleground in this eternal conflict. A secretive group called the Haradrim has kept mortals safe. But now this once powerful order is a husk of what it was. And Sanctuary's ancient creators have returned to claim the hearts of humankind. This is the story of their downfall.
so we got stranded out in the middle of the wilderness in the dark in the snow horse got killed by something um so yeah we gotta try to find ourselves some some shelter somewhere to hide hell yeah all right let's find some shelter before we freeze we do have it all right we're gonna make sure we get this the decompose we got the necromancy the necro armor or what is it called the they're like my little minions bro they're the best they're already killing it makes the game way too easy another abandoned town demons everywhere fangs in the dark he bit me careful he's a wild one what's going on here what's it to you also in hush I'm sorry, Wanderer. You've come at a difficult time. This madman just stumbled into town and started causing trouble. Demons spilling from the ruins. Kill us all. Kill us all. Ruins? What is he talking about? Come, I'll explain. There is evil staring in the ruins to the north. That poor monk back there must have gone inside. Even a holy man like him was through a net by whatever he saw. Could you protect us from whatever is out there? We have nowhere else to turn. Evil is gathering strength in those ruins. I will bring it to heal. Will I? Oh, thank you. All right, so we ended up finding some place to finally hide from the weather. But then what happened? There's demons coming from some uh, underground area and the people in the town need help. So they asked us to help. Let's go kill some demons then. Yay. We leveled up. Okay, we can you heal. Fire's looking good. But I should watch it a little longer. The woods around here are dangerous. This guy sells stuff. A two-handed sword, a scythe, and a skull. Not while I'm in town. And we unlocked. Yeah, we have one more ability point. We need to spend one more before we can get that. We'll just keep upgrading our ability. Our main one. Alright, let's go to these ruins. The Ichow ruins. Is it Ice Howl? It's gotta be Ice Howl. After a short little jaunt down the road. We found ourselves at the Ice Howl ruins. So we gotta go inside and clear out of all the demons. Let's go. Where's everybody at? Hell yeah, leveled up again. We'll get Blight. All right, we're going down the hell touched corridors. Level four. All right, this feels like a boss fight. So after killing tons of little, little freaking demon douchebags, we finally get to the end where we get attacked by this big boy. I think you pronounce it tall, but he's like the demon Baron. His name was tall, the sacred, oh no, the scarred Baron, tall, the scarred Baron. Um, yeah, he was boss of the area, but being the necromancer made it way too easy. So, you know, our little boys did work. Just because we're like walking at a straight angle instead of instead of like at a asymmetric angle. Jeez, too easy. I'm telling you, the necromancer might be the best. See what we got here. Alrighty. After we killed the big bad demon, we headed back to town for a little party with the boys. A little party with the pro. With the... A party with the people. Um... Yeah. Get a little drunk. Let's go. Time to head out. Back to the town? Let's go tell the people that we did it. We protected them. You've returned. I have. The old ruins are clear. Your town should be safe now. Truly? Ha! Huh. By the light, you are heaven sent. Oh, I'm so sorry. We, we haven't any coin to offer. 
but we have hot stew, good company, and... Stay for a pint. Wash out the taste of the stew. <laughs> <laughs> We'd be honored if you'd join us. Our savior! <laughs> <laughs> mother's blood, my mother's body. So uh, shall you witness her glory before you die. Not ready yet. No. They're coming. The whole damned village. Get up. Get up. We have to fight our way out. There. Take them. May the light preserve us. So, apparently, these people cannot be trusted. Like, the demons were coming from down the road, but the evil was already in the town. They tried to kill me, but they put blood, they put the, what do you call it? The blood of the demon in me. Like, they made me eat petals, blood petals. And I think that it, like, connected me to the main demon. But, yeah, we had to head ourselves head our way to the chapel and find out exactly what the hell is going on how did they come up with this like ritual that they were doing to me crazy i can't believe those people turned on me after i protected them they drugged me what are they gonna do they were like gonna sacrifice me to some mother <sighs> that was all of them did they curse me Adman. Those heretics drugged me after I returned from the ruins, just like you. I came to my wits and escaped, tried to get inside the chapel, but it was locked. And... What manner of evil is this? Petals of blood? They... they must have fed them to me. A blasphemous ritual. How did they learn this? Perhaps the answer lies in the chapel. They kept it locked up for a reason. The key might be on that woman who was leading them. All right, let's get the key. The chapel key. Now what? We go to the chapel. Oh, too early. Blood petals, like the ones I was fed. Is this real? Is this real? Shameful. Our father has granted you a path to salvation. <laughs> and yet you stray from it at every opportunity. You drink and gamble. 
You covet and steal. Shameful. child into this world. Thank the light. You collapsed inside. I thought the darkness had swallowed you. I dragged you here and put this cursed place to the torch. What happened to you in there? I saw a vision. A horned demon. He said the Lords of Hell are coming. She wanted to help the people survive. Help them? She called them her children and they welcomed her like... A mother. Mother? No. It cannot be. I must report to the cathedral. Listen, there is a hermit to the northeast. A man of questionable loyalty. But he knows of the forbidden. He might be useful to us. Into the cathedral in Kiovashad. And you will be in the light's favor. So, we get sent to go find this hermit. Apparently he knows a lot about the forbidden. So we're gonna go find him and then walk with him to the city and Meet up at the cathedral and then figure out what is the next move? For stopping Lilith from making more children, I guess Sheesh all right, that was crazy. So now Lilith is free and she's trying to wake all her children up all right let's go we are going to the hermit's cabin which way is it this way can we uh i assume it's like right here the windsept cabin is anyone here after a nice little walk through the woods at night in the snow we come upon our destination we finally found the hermit's little place hopefully he's gonna come with us and help us 
short fangs, young, freshly turned, an easy kill. Further south than the others, they're spreading. All right, whatever he's talking about, they're spreading. to join me for supper. I'm bloody hungry. That's quite the story. I wish it wasn't true. But it is. Why did I have that vision? Thank those friendly villagers. They gave you the blood of Lilith. The blood of a demon? Not just any demon. The daughter of hatred. The mother of sanctuary. She was banished ages ago. But this world is her creation. <sighs> it was prophesied she would come back. What does she want? That's the question. Sanctuary has always been trapped amid the eternal conflict. A war between angels and demons. But Lilith serves neither side. She has her own plans for us. And me? Am I corrupted? Not sure yet. But you two share a connection. What will you do about it? Use it. Find out what she's after. Good. Then we're in this together. Rest while you can. Then we'll start in Kiovashad. If we can't stop Lilith, we'll all be damned. Hey, after getting to know our bro a little bit, the next morning, we're off. We're gonna go to the city. Kiavashad and meet with the cathedral, I guess.